Yo, Longley, do you realize what you did tonight? Oh, mama, I'm the sexiest turtle in the pond. Dude, where were you and why do you smell like swamp ass? Hey man, what do you want? I live in a swamp, dude. Oh, it's one of those people. Get a job, man. Yo, what the fuck pissed on my bed? We dipped. I've never run that fast in my entire life. That's not because you're a turtle. That's just because you're a berry head. Dude, I'm not a berry head. How did we get there anyway? Yo, what's good for tonight? Let's get buried and push shopping carts into the lake again. I got some red berries from Schmeagle. Hibba jibba. Oh, is that your buddy from Hebrew school? Yep, the kid who pissed in Lindsay Lohan's cereal. Always pissing in the wrong places, oh, yeah. that one. i love to, but no. Here's what we're doing instead. There's a huge banger at some kids from Millville's house. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Millville? That's out in the hills. How did you hear about that? Sam. Hummingbird Sam? Yeah, the hot one. She wants it, dude. I give her my card. Your card? Yeah, with all my contact info. <laughs> what century do you live in? The way to bag a classic girl like Sam isn't through Fishbook anymore, man. That's old news. They want something they can hold on to, a more physical interaction. Yeah, I'm sure that Sam wants to hold on to that scrawny-ass tail. Dude, tails run small in my family. It's hereditary. What's that mean? I don't know. I just say it and people feel bad for me. I think it's covered under Olamacare. Anyways... Who's going to be at this party? Anyone we know? I don't want to show up to some house in Millville unannounced. You get stampeded doing something like that. Yeah, dude, the whole lax team will be there. Plus Geppetto. Geppetto! Geppetto! I guess, more importantly, what kind of girls are going to be there? All of the junior pigeons, if you're into that. Like the ones who follow Sam around and squawk like it's fucking Labor Day. Oh... So it's that kind of party. Yeah, that kind. You gonna put that away, or do I have to take it and use it as a hot plate? No, but I believe you have something for me. Kids. This is Bodhi.
By far the most underqualified teacher on the school staff, this panther tries to teach science to 11th graders, a subject that he has failed more times than he has passed. In his free time, he is also a somewhat successful entrepreneur and a somewhat functioning alcoholic. You guys serious right now? Lordy Lord. I just got these from Smeagol. Uh, what are they? These are the best red berries you can get on the street. Smeagol gave me a good deal because we were cool in Hebrew school. Should we do them now or save them for the party tonight? Don't be a pussy, dude. Let's do them all now. Dude, what the jibba? This is Cole. Cole spends his days attempting to teach English to 10th grade remedials and volunteers as a lifeguard at the local female penitentiary, where just last week he was almost raped and eaten by a mother hippopotamus in heat. But don't tell anyone. Well, boys, what do we have here? Fondling each other's prostates? Nothing, Cole. Hey, that's Mr. Cole to you. No, it isn't. Yeah, Cole. Cole. We were just, uh, um, uh, studying. In the bathroom? You boys aren't, uh, doing drugs now, are you? Us? <laughs> Come on, never. <laughs> hip, 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 hip. Luckily, Cole didn't do anything. <laughs> yeah, the luck of the fox. Yeah, I want a milkshake. Cole, he's pretty chill. He and Bodie are my favorite teachers. You think they have lives outside of school? <laughs> no way. Teachers are responsible, man. They probably don't even drink. Oh man, what a night. Are you nuts, bro? I mean, do you, do you know what just happened? Yeah, we almost got killed. It's pretty fucking classic. What's up, bro? <clears throat> Welcome to Max Roadside Diner. Can I get you started with some drinks? Oh, I heard just drinks, bro. Give me a Long Island iced tea. Go ahead and double everything. Should we get shots too? Sir, this is a diner, not some Soviet shithole. Uh... Okay, just whatever you have on tap then. Uh, we have milkshakes. Wow. Okay, fine. What does a tiger have to do to get a buzz around here? This place is lame, bro. Don't worry about it. Luckily, you're in luck. The boatster came prepared for such an occasion. I still can't believe you aren't pissing your pants after what just happened. I'm way past that point. I let loose on that Guido's leather seats. Couldn't hold it in, bro. Um, what Guido? Is he cute? She's really into juicers. Well, he was a wiener. Alright, the party's arrived, ladies! Hey man, there's a five dollar cover charge. Here you go, big boy. Buy yourself a... A carrot or something. So, give us the most absurd beverage in your establishment. Two of them. We plan on dying tonight. Well, almost. Okay, bro. What's the game plan tonight? I'll work on the marsupials. You go for the ocean dwellers. I see a lot of potential here. A lot of potential. Sounds good to the sea man. Damn! Damn! You are without a doubt the pinkest flamingo I have ever seen. <laughs> Let me ask you something, sweet beak. You ever hear of Bodie's better body? OMG! I knew I recognized you from somewhere. I have all your DVDs. Now, to all you animals out there, that's how you work up a sweat. Tell me off, sweethearts. Love you, Bodie! Your friend better be careful, man. 
You don't know what he's doing. <laughs> Careful. Hey, you just keep making the drinks, guy. Heed my warning, you silly tiger. That dare bird is off limits. Your friend don't know who he'd be pissing off. I call this one the thrust. Strengthens your quads and back. I do it with all my clients. What's this? Mario, Randall, tell me that my eyes aren't seeing what my eyes are seeing. Well, boss, it looks like some jungle cat if, uh, what's the word? Noodling. Yeah, canoodling. He's canoodling with your wife. That's exactly what my eyes are seeing. I'll have none of this. What the fuck? Hey, bro, hey, bro. easy on the fur. I just had it fluffed. Where are we? I think we're in a car. But more importantly, I think I just broke my seal. That's gross, man. Do you know who I am? No. No. Wait, aren't you the new janitor at the school? No, it's not him, bro. That guy's a bullfrog. This guy's a chameleon or a chicken or something. Ah! Be careful, dude. I have razor burn. You don't disrespect the Don. The, the Don? Like, like in The Godfather. Like, like the Mafia? We can neither confirm nor deny that. Yeah, like the CIA. In my clubs, you play by my rules. And you broke rule number one. No glory holes in the stall? I told you not to do that. Yeah, but I couldn't resist. What? No, you dumb witted nincompoops. Nincompoops? Nincompoops. You were seen canoodling with a certain avian individual who happens to be my wife. Now, I'm a man of principle. And this sort of behavior is unacceptable. There must be repercussions. Now, normally, I would cut off your pecker. But, seeing as how I'm getting laid tonight, I'm in a forgiving mood. I'll let you guys off with a warning. But if I ever see you tools again in my club, I'll remove your nut sacks and feed them to Bartholomew here. Now get them out of my sight. <laughs> classic, bro. Not classic. Definitely not classic. I'm not trying to do that again. That story was boring. Yeah. Uh, sir, once again, you can't drink in here, okay? This isn't some Guatemalan whorehouse. And ma'am, you need to put some clothes on. Wait, when did we find these girls? So, right. can we, like, find some berries? Yeah, you said you had- I said I knew a guy. If only those dumbass kids were here. Yo, I still think we are forgetting something important. I don't... now. But does anyone here have a coconut? You can't say things like that, man. At this stage in the story. Yeah. Wait, so then what happened? I was driving. I'll literally spawn with anything tonight. Feel me, Jabetta? Someone give me the address. 42 Flower Flounder Road. Rodrigo hashtagged it. Millville? Is Rodrigo the vampire bat? Uh, I think he's a fruit bat. Yeah, the kid who's dating the flamingo. Yeah, I always wonder what she was doing with that blood sucker. He's not a vampire, he's a fruit bat. Open your fucking ears, man. Hibba jibba. I just don't know anyone in the hills. This party could get weird. 
I'll tell you what we need. We need to call the inspector. He'll know what to do. He always comes through in the clubs. Wasn't he leaving for Antarctica the last time we saw him? Antarctica? <sighs> yeah, he's back. He was rescuing penguins or some shit. I don't know. That guy weirds me out. Why? He's always doing something. Like thwarting terrorism? He's kind of, um, a wild card. He's unconventional. Yeah, unconventional. But he's always there when you need him. I went there once. <laughs> Antarctica? Yeah. What happened? I don't remember. Here we are, boys. This is going to be an awesome night. Let's go over the ground rules in case we find ourselves in a sticky situation. Don't pass out with your shoes on. Or at all. That's just weak. Geppetto, no making out in public. If the cops come, you're under 21, but you forgot your ID. And Longley, in your case, your green card. You didn't have any alcohol, and you were brought here completely against your will. Oh, and no, they can't search you because your dad's a lawyer. Yosef, don't die. And rule number one, under any and all circumstances, no dancing. Hey, look, there's Sam. Hey, y'all, I'm Samantha. You can call me Sam. Uh, I love you. What? I mean, wait, what? I'm Geppetto. So, Sam, what do you say my next drink's on you? Um, enticing, but I think the liquor's all gone. No liquor? Well, that's a disappointment. I didn't realize this was a fucking PTA meeting. Well... Looks like I'll be gone. Isn't the inspector... Ah! What the fuck? Oh shit, it's the inspector. Him and Shiva. What's up, inspector? Gentlemen. <laughs> inspector, what's up, dude? Nice of you to show. Yes, I was expecting I would be here. Did you expect you to arrive at a boozeless party? I always expect everything. When I plan on being a party to shenanigans, like I am now, I always make sure there's an escape route in reach. So, where's your escape route now? My dear, it's right over there. Hello? Think that trick came in handy in Her Majesty's Royal Service? Inspector, how did you get my number? I have everybody's number. Now look to your left. Whoa. So I assume you lads are still trying to party. Yeah, we're still trying to party. That was rhetorical. If you said no, I would have drugged your pond water. Well... Do you have any booze? Booze? Huh. 
I don't mingle with peasants, boy. I have something much better than that. Follow me. Okay. Good enough for me. Is Sam coming? Nah, dude. Sam's not the kind of girl that walks in the bathroom with three dudes. Here you go, old sport. Have a gander at these. Thanks, Inspector. You always come through in the clutch. It's what I do. Plus, your shell reminds me of my first wife. Her eyes were that color. Thanks. I just had it waxed. Uh, I just had my ears shaved. These berries are of the highest quality. They're legitimate blackberries. I acquired them from a nomad for five measly ruples during my travels in the Shahara. It turns out they were worth a small fortune. Stupid fucking nomads. What's so special about them? These will make you see unicorns, literally. Oh man, uh, should we be doing this? Didn't we literally just get busted for berries? Like today? guys. Uh, here. Grow some balls, boy. Do you want people to think you're a shishy rabbit? Uh, I'm actually a cat. Whoa, man. I'm starting to see things. What's good, my reptilian brother? <laughs> Who are you? My name's Cletus. Here, have some more liquor. It's good for the soul, feels me? Yes. What's your name? Yosef. Are you like an antelope or something? Giraffe. I can reach higher branches. Y'all slay from trees? <laughs> That's so indigenous. Yeah, so retro. What's up, Seth? Who are the ladies? Your friend's weird. My friend's cool as shit. He brings something to the table, we think. You're the one who's the fish out of the water. She was talking to Joseph. Yosef. Wait, so who's weird? You want to get out of here? The little fox is creeping me out. Wow, are those scales even real? Oh my goodness. Whoa. Whoa. This, this is crazy. Whoa. You feel that little tingle in your tailbone? That's called transcendence. A higher level of existence. <laughs> Looks like your buddy is having a great time. You gotta go to the bathroom now? Don't you? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Longley got fucked up. Hibba jibba. <laughs> Great night. People will be talking about this one for generations to come. 
I think. Where's Geppetto? I think he got with that girl, the one with all of those legs. He must have gone home with her. A centipede? Yeah. Jules. Nah, that was me. Insects, bro. Are you sure? Yeah. I won't be forgetting those legs anytime soon. At least not the first 12. Or the last 15. The middle ones, they just kind of got in the way. I thought that was Geppetto the whole time. No, that's a coat rack, buddy. You're still tripping. Oh, that explains a lot. Ooh. There's no reason Geppetto shouldn't be with us right now. Holy shit. Did we leave him at the godforsaken house? That would appear evident now, wouldn't it? He's right. There's something fishy here. Uh, you guys... We have to go back and find him. I'm not going back there. That place was horrible. A true nightmare. Yeah, we yeah. have to go back. Yeah. Alright, I think you guys need to leave. This isn't some afghanistan sweatshop where you can do whatever you like. <coughs> okay, fuck you, bro. If you don't want our business. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Oh dear. It looks like someone had a little too much to drink tonight. Yeah, yeah. That's what my lawyer keeps saying. F <coughs> fuck him and fuck you too. My heavens. Hey look, Cole. It's the fucking kids. Late night diner run. Classic. Thank God you're here. We need some help. Whoa, whoa. Slow down there, Lance Armstrong. Where are you boys coming from? We, you know, we, we were just at a party. Nice. Any ladies there? <laughs> yeah. Tons. We lost Geppetto. Geppetto? I fucking love that kid. Oh, my. What do you mean you lost him? Like... We have no idea where he is. We rolled up with him at the beginning of the night, and now he's missing. We have no idea where he is. And you need our help. We, we need you to drive us past my curfew. Back to the party? I may have had a few too many drinks, according to Dolores over here. Don't worry. I got this, bro. You're more drunk than I am. No, I'm not. You just pissed in the Mafia's limo. Wait, what? I don't really want to go back. What the fuck? Why not? Daywalkers. They give me the heebie-jeebies. Your weird friend's got a point, little bros. Um... What are daywalkers? Uh, you know, the, uh, the low I say. Stay around the party after it ends and... Just linger around till morning. Everybody passes out. You can always spot the daywalkers sitting in the garage, chain ripping new ports, eating onion rings, and telling stories about God knows what. You never go back to a party after the sun comes up. What do you do when you're not with us? The goofy giraffe is right. I read somewhere, I think in the back of a hustler, that an appropriate waiting period is three days. But I'd give it a week. But we have to find Geppetto. We can't just leave him there. They'll eat his frail little soul alive. Ugh. All right. Give us a minute. 
Any berries at this place? Oh, yeah, it was a party. Well, then we're in. You think Geppetto's still at the house? Kid, you have no idea how much trouble you're in. You're gonna fry. Yeah, you could say the future ain't looking too bright for you. Where you can't get what you want, but you can't get me. 